Five animals that could defeat a king cobra. The king cobra snake, Ophiophagus hanna, is the largest venomous snake in the world. The king cobra snake is also perhaps the most dangerous snake in the world where humans are concerned. Under conditions of high prey availability, they can reach a length of 18.5 feet, 5.6 meters. Several people die from the bite of the king cobra each year. A king cobra can even kill an elephant. The king cobra is the sole member of its genus. It is classified as part of family Elapidae, the cobra family. Hamadriad, the alternative common name for the snake, is a Greek word meaning wood nymph. Their venom is not the most potent among venomous snakes, however, the amount of neurotoxin they can deliver in a single bite, up to two-tenths of a fluid ounce, seven milliliters. Fortunately, king cobras are shy and will avoid humans whenever possible. King cobra snakes are fiercely aggressive when cornered or provoked. Before we get started, I wanted to remind you that if you want to watch more videos about animals, even prehistoric animals, I recommend you subscribe to the Wild Facts channel. I leave the link in the description. Thanks. Number 5. Mongooses For an animal, trying to kill a snake is almost equal to suicide, but mongooses have some advantages and tricks of their own. The mongoose is known for its ability to fight and kill venomous snakes, especially cobras. Their specialized acetylcholine receptors render them immune to venom, while their thick coats and quick speed also come in handy during conflicts. Firstly, these little mammals live in a group of 10 to 40 mongooses, so surely it would be hard for the most tactical snake to handle so many mongoose at a time. To kill the snake, the group of mongooses surround it and then try to close in from different directions. The snake is constantly distracted by the surrounding mongooses who try to bite it. It is likely that a single mongoose cannot kill a cobra king, although there has been a case where a mongoose has managed to kill a 10-foot cobra king. But certainly, if we're talking about a mongoose team working simultaneously, I'm sure they'll be able to kill a bigger king cobra as well. Number 4. Python I know that when I made the video Python vs King Cobra, I tipped the scales in favor of Cobra, but that doesn't mean she can't be killed by a python. As one of the elipids, the King Cobra kills its prey through its venom, which is injected through its hollow fangs, while pythons rely on their abilities to camouflage, weight, and strength in constricting. There are many different types of python, but this kind of duel has happened before. If I remember correctly, there was a battle between a king cobra and a reticulated python. The result? Both died. The python managed to entangle the cobra and crush it completely, but not before the king cobra got a bite in and killed the python with its toxic venom. They died entangled and with great struggle. On the other hand, if Python got its grip on the cobra before cobra could bite the python, then python will be able to win against the cobra. Once python gets its grip on its prey, they don't leave them alive. Pythons, with their skills, can crush their prey's bones, stop their prey's heart by their body weight or their prey's won't be able to breathe while they are in python's tight grip. Number 3. Honey Badger Speaking of bites, the honey badger can survive the bites of some very dangerous creatures. They eat scorpions and snakes, and they have an unusually strong immunity to venom. But is it possible that the honey badger could actually survive a bite from a king cobra? After extensive research conducted by Christopher Orr, the Atlantic senior editor in charge of our small rabid animal coverage, the honey badger surely can indeed survive a bite from a king cobra. Humans can't, even elephants can't, which is yet another reason why the honey badger is a badass. 
So surely, if a mongoose that is much smaller than a honey badger can defeat a cobra king, surely our little one can do that too. After all, it is not for nothing that it is called the toughest animal on the planet. Number 2. Eagles There is a species of eagle called the serpent eagle, which feeds on snakes. It may not feed exclusively on snakes, but can eat snakes like cobras which can form a large part of its diet. Eagles, or for that matter any raptor, including the eagle, will never get into a fight situation with a venomous snake. With its razor-sharp eyesight, a raptor can see the snake from a great height. After that, it is purely an aerial attack. The raptor will dive and swoop down on its prey, pick it up in its sharp talons, and fly away back to a dizzying height. The sharp talons of the eagle hold onto the snake with a vice grip, and the bird knows how to hold it in a way that the snake cannot turn back and bite. Being suddenly airborne is enough to disorient the cobra. The serpent eagle then lands on a tree or a rock with some impact, which stuns the snake. After biting off the snake's head, the eagle then goes on to enjoy his meal. For all the poison they pack, snakes are pretty helpless and vulnerable creatures when the attack comes from the air. And if we talk about a larger species of eagle, such as the golden eagle or harpy eagle, which are known to attack animals much larger than themselves, such as wolves, I wouldn't be surprised if he did this with a king cobra. Number 1. Monitor Lizards While King Cobras and Komodo Dragons live in different places, there are areas where Cobras and Monitor Lizards do coexist. And those Monitor Lizards are fine with eating the Cobras, no matter how much they try to bite them. For the same reason a Viper doesn't affect a Komodo Dragon. So, between Komodo Dragon being basically impervious to Viper Bite, and other monitor lizards being impervious to cobra bites, and Komodo dragon being the biggest and toughest monitor lizard of them all, I assume that the Komodo dragon would easily eat the king cobra, and the king cobra would not be able to harm the Komodo dragon. So if the Komodo dragon was inclined to attack a king cobra, and had an immunity to the king's venom, and had skin too tough for the cobra's fangs to penetrate, you will realize how this scenario would end. Even if we say that the cobra venom would have an effect on the Komodo dragon, I think the lizard will be able to kill the snake before it takes effect. So, in both cases, the Cobra King would be dead anyway. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button. Until next time, Farewell.